I was out checking that trail camera. Um, actually, I'm checking a couple. Feels good to be out with my knee. My knee feels great. I wanted to get into an area uh, that I knew would uh, have some bulls hanging out. And as you can see, here's some moose rubs. I've already seen about, geez, 30, 40 rubs in this area. And uh, it's coming in here, looking at those rubs, and because I stopped and I look. I don't have a dog right now with me, but I got a fresh moose antler right here. Not a big one, but it's a nice one. Nice color. Let's see? Beautiful. Wow, thick. Thick antler. So, wonder if I got him on video this summer. But this is a kind of area I like. And uh, I think Ruger's with me. So, thanks, buddy. All right, let's take a look at this. I already did, actually. <laughs> Just forgot to video it. It's a nice one. It's a piece of brown, fresh. It's nice. I always love finding moose sheds, you know? One of my favorite things to do, actually. So, so again, just a nice area. It's not a big area in here. It's just a small kind of bowl. But I'm gonna see if I can find the other one. Without a dog or Ruger, probably, you know, it's possible, but <laughs> so much easier when I had Ruger. Uh, anyway, it's still a beautiful day. I'm still looking for the other side of that antler. I haven't found it yet. But I wanted to show you guys this. I love moose rubs. This is a nice one. Because <laughs> I always hoped that there'd be a moose antler at the base of it, but not on this one. This boy's been rubbing. I mean, that's awesome. Yeah, that's, that's a good moose rub right there. But I'm going to keep looking for this other side. <clears throat> that I've just been gritting kind of zigzagging back and forth and crossing my tracks and uh, well, well we'll see what happens if not well it's a good day in the woods <laughs>